So the ANC's chairperson in Ekuruleni, that's Mzwani Masina, is said to face disciplinary action from the party's provincial structure. Masina is in hot water for defying an instruction to withdraw a motion of no confidence against Mayor Tanya Campbell. The province says Masina has brought the party into disrepute by undermining decisions around coalition agreements in municipalities in Gauteng. The party held a media briefing yesterday. Newsroom Africa's Palani Pahari was there. The ANC in Rauteng says Mzwandile Masina had gone against party decisions and should be disciplined for such actions. The charge against him is bringing the party into disrepute. I can confirm that uh, the provincial secretary have convened the provincial working committee uh, to attend and process this matter. Uh, as soon as we've concluded it, then we'll make a, a public pronouncement, but obviously... Uh, the chairperson has the right also to, uh, to be notified, to be aware of all these things. So we don't want to do it through this platform. Secretary Tembinko T.K. Ngliza says the ANC in Ikruleni has delayed the party's coalition efforts. He says the party has taken a firm stance to discipline all those who sought to undermine the negotiation of coalitions. Newsroom Africa has reached out to Masina, who is yet to react to the decision of the PEC to discipline him. At the same time, the regional task team on the West Rand has been disbanded. The RTT of West Rand and its same of office has lapsed after it has been given a mandate to take the region to the regional conference not later than June, the 20, uh, June uh, 2022. All the regional conferences of the ANC in Gauteng were held successfully with the exception of West Rand region. The ANC, in Gauteng, the ANC Working Committee within seven days, must install the regional task team in West Rand. For Newsroom Africa, Channel 405, I'm Pilani Pahadi in Johannesburg.